mean that we are in the uh, infamous rodent. Woo! This is so cool. <laughs> Streetcar. Yeah. <You. laughs> so this is uh, obviously the car that Powertune completely built from the ground up. And uh, it come in with a whole host of parts that the owner wanted fitted. And it kind of escalated from there, didn't it? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, the owner brought in, I guess, a lot of the, the turbo parts, etc. cetera. Um, we fitted it all up. Uh, we supplied them the MoTeC, obviously. Um, the X-Shift sequential, uh, to a six-speed sequential on it. Um, it's also got this uh, new dash that we're using. Uh, can check that dash. I'm not sure if you can see that, but it's got a touch screen. It's pretty cool. Cool mount as well. That is, uh, that's another thing that you can inquire about because it, you can get that for all sorts of different cars, can't you? Yes, correct. Yeah. yeah. This car has done a track day now, so uh, it got the absolute hell beaten out of it, to be honest. <laughs> Everyone was driving it all day long and it didn't get turned off once. It's it was actually quite a good test for the car because... Um, it's on pump fuel too as well. Yeah, everyone was loving it. And there was AMG GDRs, Nismo GDRs, and everyone wanted to come back in the old rodent. It was cool. So how much power does this make? On pump fuel, it makes 300. 300 kilowatt out of a three-cylinder. Hub kilowatts. Oh, hub kilowatts. Yeah, just for those who... <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, like today I've got a very sore leg, um, so I, I can't use the clutch. Um, oh. As you can see, it's it's all clutchless. It's so good. <laughs> oh shit, no. It's, it's better now. <laughs> <laughs> That's so cool though. Auto blip down. Yeah. And then uh, obviously shift cut going up. So, what else is this thing's got? So many cool things. It's obviously got new Recaros in it. You can't see them because we've got car covers on. And um, it's got the roll cage from. Uh, oh yeah. I A AGI? No, not this. This hasn't got the AGI one. I think it's Ministry of Fabrication. Oh, Ministry of Fab. Well, this cage. Yeah. Oh, another one. Right. Jeez, Mexico's full of bloody. Cartel members today. He's just having smogo. What's he doing there? <laughs> I think it's illegal, mate. I think he wanted a bit of shade. Yeah. <laughs> so it also has an interesting exhaust on this car. Yeah, it is, uh, it's got an Acura Povich exhaust. Uh, what? Titanium, yeah, your Aussies. This. <laughs> it's got an Aaron exhaust, so it's easier to drive, right, without the clutch. Yeah. It's, it's actually smoother. Yeah, it's harder to drive with the clutch. Yeah. Agree? Yep, totally agree. This thing's pretty cool. You actually, obviously, you got everything that Motec is reading. You can display on here. Um, as an example, it's got obviously your lambda, um, fuel composition, obviously all your temperatures. Uh, I think from memory, it's actually got um, uh, tire pressures. It's got a G sensor in there as well. Takes an, an SD card as a. Does it do logging? Does logging? Wow. Yeah. How good. Oil tank, oh yeah. yeah and you boost. can fit it in your air con vent. Yeah man, it's got your boost aim as well, so it'll tell you what you're aiming for. <laughs> you sell them separately? Yep. Yeah. So they, can they run them on a standard ECU? Yes, you can run them yeah. on a standard ECU as well. Well how it works is, um, obviously whatever the ECU is spitting out on, on the CAN bus, you can actually tap into. Yep. And actually, as long as you've got um, the correct file in it, you can actually display. So they set price for every single car, or? Yes, they are actually, yeah. 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 Do you know the uh, RRP there, mate? <laughs> <laughs> I 
Yeah. I should. Yeah. Talk to the sales guy. <laughs> oh, jeez. Yeah. This is a cool car. We have done a video on this, haven't we? Yeah, we did. I think we did, actually. Yeah, after, yeah we did. I think you driving, actually. But it wasn't totally finished. No, now it's... Yeah, we've had some more time with it. And it's got its new look, obviously. You guys have seen that. That's ridiculous, isn't it? Yeah, it's sore. <laughs> sore from all those cars with heavy clutches, hey? <laughs> Actually, the club sprint guys will be um, happy now that you can run a sequential for all time attack. Oh, you can. Okay. And we got them in stock. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think of that. Yeah, that great gearbox. Any guys want to run it? Like race, the race series? Any racing? Yeah. We're going to try and um, talk uh, road into using this at World Time Attack next year. Yeah. <laughs> I think you should enter. Yeah. If you're watching this, Pete, please. <laughs> enter, you'll have a blast. Please, Pete. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> What lap time do you reckon this would do? I'm not sure. I've seen um, like, uh, the Aris's last year, they, they were like sub 40s. Um, oh, like, yeah? yeah? I think they were like 30. Don't quote me on it. 37s. That's not bad. It's flying. What? What'd they have done to them? I believe they were standard engines still. Um, just, I guess all the, all the bolt ons, upgraded turbo, <laughs> suspension, good driving. Wow. I don't know how many cameras there in his car. There's, there's one there. Oh, there there's, is two. There's one there. There's one there. <laughs> I didn't even notice that they've got their own dash cam yeah. with audio. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh guys. <laughs> I didn't mean what I said, Pete. I was just joking. <laughs> <laughs> Scott, also, I was just, it was all jokes. Sick, hey. How good is it? So sick, man. Just bloop. That's crazy. Oh, and uh, <coughs> Scott, if you're watching, mate, just remember. That's all I'll say. Yeah. <laughs> well, he didn't really say anything. Just. <laughs> yeah, true. That's all I'll do. <laughs> for the button. Oh, what button? Eject button. Oh. <laughs> the other cool thing this, can, this guy can do, yeah. you can actually put buttons on it, on the screen, and make it a switch. That makes sense. Like a can switch. Oh, yeah? So they can tell the ECU, example, boost level, I guess traction level. On a touch, so you, like, I guess it, it could almost act as, like, it can act as a, a keypad almost. Oh, true. On a driver switch, yeah. So can you integrate that with a MoTeC? Yes, absolutely. Oh, wow. Interesting. So instead of getting a keypad, you can get... What are uh, they called? A can checked. A what? Can checked. Can checked. Yeah, can checked. C-A-N and then C-H-E. <laughs> C, I think it is. K-D. Oh, check. Yeah. Can check. Can check screen. Yeah, can check screen. Yeah, and right. it's got logging on it too, so man, it's like you got a you got a logger, you got a display, and you got a keypad. Wow. Ah. And it looks like it reacts really quickly. Yeah man. Like time wise. Yeah. Do you know how some dashes are laggy? You mean the power tune one? Yeah. That's a <laughs> rip off of that name, eh? That's so bad. <laughs> so, so bad. But and just so everyone knows, because we get phone calls all the time, PowerTune Digital is not <laughs> PowerTune Australia. It is not. Sorry, microphone, but I, <laughs> I had to emphasize that. <laughs> yeah, like daily. Yeah, yeah we're at, honestly, they ring us daily. Yeah, we're having trouble with your dash. And we just instantly say, is it a PowerTune Digital Dash? And they're like, yeah, they're like, sorry, mate, got the wrong company. <laughs> That's what you say. I tell them. Mate, have some respect for your car. 
<laughs> That's a good point, actually. Yeah. No, That's a good point. Yeah. There's a better one right there. Just sitting in the air convent. Yeah, man. Much better. Yeah. Can check. It really needs a boot, eh? It does. It does, man. I just said on yesterday's video yeah. how we make sure, you know. Because yeah. you can get universal boots. Maybe we should actually commission somebody to make, you know, a, a run of them. If you do um, interior pieces. Yeah. And you want to do a collaboration with us. We're keen. Yeah. So we need something that fits in there. Like a nice, I don't know, even if it was, um, looked like some sort of material like this. Or, oh yeah. I'm thinking like that. Yeah, true. For this car, it'd actually be nice if it was in like, oh, red. do you think? Yeah. We should ask Pete. Mm. See what he wants. Mm. We'll get onto it though. But if anyone's out there that can help us, uh, hit us up in the comments and I'll be straight onto it. Actually, that's a good idea. Every time you do a video, you can actually, if there's somebody who can do something that's wicked, you know. That's true. That's really good. That is that, true. That's watching. I mean, at least it shows that, they, that they're interested in this, this type of stuff that we do. Yeah. She is always trying to improve stuff, always. Hence why this car is still getting tuned. Like he always says, a car is never perfect. So effortless, eh? Hey. Can you see that? Yeah. It's Gran Turismo. All wheel drive. Oh. Yeah, you I knew that, man. See, it's got front axles and rear axles? Yeah. Yeah, I knew that, bro. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, we can go this way. It's crazy how much torque this thing's got. I know, eh? It's just dumb. It's ridiculous. And obviously, you can feel it from the, like, from the passenger seat. It's yeah. Like, it's a three cylinder. It just keeps hauling ass. Man, I told you the first time I drove it, I was like, how the f is this? It just... I guess I, I went into the car thinking three cylinder, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and it was, yeah, 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 nah. nah. <laughs> <laughs> I learned that from the best. <laughs> got that shift dialed, eh? Driver. You've changed that today, haven't you? Driver. Di <laughs> different driver today. so much fun this thing, eh? It is, it? Man, this is so good. I wonder if Pete wants it back so yeah. he can go cruising on the weekend. 100%. Chicks love it. Yeah. <laughs> Three cylinder. Three cylinder. <laughs> Easy clutch. I don't use the clutch now. So this is all clutch. It's car, man. Oh, come on, lefter. It's just so much smoother. <laughs> All right, so now using no clutch. This is one of the easiest dailies. Yeah. 
like performance for its performance value versus drivability. Yeah, man, it's it's like up there with one of the best. It is, man. Yeah. Like, and the car like potentially around a ten second pass. Like yeah. that's that's plenty of acceleration. Um, yeah, it's it's freaking crazy. You don't need to go and change your tyres and do this and give it. You know the it's just get their drive like you know. On a bad day, you're gonna run a low, low 11. Yeah. It's very fast. And then it uses. Oh, Poucher and customer, I gotta get this one. Yeah, you better get that, mate. Poucher and Jake speaking. <coughs> yeah, the other good thing about being this being a daily car, the other really, really good thing about it, yep. especially with today's petrol prices. Oh. It doesn't use any. Really? But it's a three cylinder, like. It's, it's very efficient. Yeah. Direct and port injection. Like, like if you're driving a car, like, I guess, it's, yeah, I mean, a performance car these days in Sydney, like, it's on ethanol, and uh, it's, you're constantly at the server. True. So, that's a good thing. So, how many of these have you built now, like Yaris's? A few, eh? There's been quite a few through the shop. Yeah. It's crazy. Yeah. They're all, they're all quite big builds too. Yeah. People just go to town on them. Yeah, it's amazing. And now you can't get them. Yeah. <laughs> Is there anything you want to wrap up on? Uh, <clears throat> no, I think we've gone through everything. Yeah. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed that one. And uh, if anyone wants any info on any of the parts on this car, uh, we obviously stock gearboxes, those screens now. And um, there's a whole host of parts that we do here. And also the Motec plug-in kit, so. And we've done everything, we can do everything. The seats, the whole kit caboodle, half the roll cage. Quite crazy. Credit to Chair and his boys, that's for sure. Power train special touch. <laughs> Don't forget it, three cylinder. <laughs> See you guys.